gonna, gonna let my head down for this. <laughs> okay, that just happened. Wow. <laughs> Welcome, Nation, to uh, Sunday Best Episode 7. And as you can see, love is in the air. Oh, in love, the love, love, I love, love, love. Don't you love love, Asura? Yeah, no. well, dude, I'm a Libra, bro. Libra is love, love. Bro. Oh, so, really? They love to yeah. be loved. Do they love giving love, though? Because I dated Yeah, they love giving love. Mm-hmm. Yeah, mm-hmm. she... She was very affectionate. Well, she won't give me love anymore, but that, hey, that's a long story, bro. <laughs> yeah, because, you know, I know all about it, bro, because once a Libra is done with you, they're done. So. Damn. <laughs> yeah, no, me, me, I cut people off fast, bro. I cut people off fast. And that's so hectic. I'm a cancer and I'm loyal as fuck, bro. I'll never cut you off. Yo. Oh, really? A cancer is loyal? Yeah, cancer is loyal as oh. fuck. Oh, I didn't know that. Yeah, it's it's but we're also untrustworthy, so balance oh but i thought scorpios were the worst because scorpios yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> they will they will sting bro that's you will feel that sting <laughs> uh, bring some baggage to the episode ladies and gentlemen sorry sorry about that ladies and gentlemen sorry about that. <laughs> we do not discriminate against scorpios <laughs> or scorpions well i don't know if you're a mortal combat uh, fan <laughs> You could discriminate against Scorpion. <laughs> I wonder what Star Sign Scorpion was. <laughs> Plot twist, bro. Yeah, Scorpion probably, is a Libra. Yeah. Or like a Pisces, like a fish. Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, man. Yeah, man. Uh, are you excited for tomorrow or today? That is Valentine's Day. I, uh, is it is it going down in the DMs? What's um, it? no, it wouldn't go down in DMs. I have a girlfriend. You love it to so. go. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. So Sorry. we're in two different lanes here. I forget. We're yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Although I don't know, if, I don't know if it's going down in the DMs for her. I mean, <laughs> <laughs> I know guys are thirsty out there, you know. Yeah, so too much, yeah, too much. Yeah. Mm-hmm. But also a lot of, I'm sure a lot of women are looking for love. Or should I just say penis? Mm. You know? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, yeah. Hey, no, I feel sorry for uh, people who are in a polyamorous relationship. Valentine's why? Day must be messy. Valentine's Day must no, be messy. No, why? Why would it be messy? I mean, look, people have this misconception that love is only monogamy. Love is uncon- like it's universal. You can love everyone and everything. <laughs> There's only 24 hours in a day and somebody's going to get the rough end of the stick. I mean, it's always nice to watch. We watch our phones. I mean, why can't we just watch? (laughs) (laughs) Wow. Okay. (laughs) What's it called? Voyeurism, is it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah. People go on the voyage of voyeurism. Yeah, but now... And it's it's wonderful. (laughs) (laughs) Now saying you're in a, a polyamorous relationship though, bro. You got like three girlfriends. There's two guys as well for some reason. It's messy, dude. It can get very, very messy. No, you what you do is you have a group event. Oh, okay. So you gotta <laughs> book out a restaurant or something. <laughs> yeah, no, I mean you go to a park or go on a hike as a group, <laughs> you know, and then just Are these like poly- funnel each <laughs> other together, you know, in or one massive orgy. You know, <laughs> I mean, they could have a massive orgy if they wanted to. It's probably they lots could, of fun. Yeah. That's like, the, mm-hmm. like the Greeks used to do it. Mm. Yeah, that's what also the like used in, to do. Mm. Like in, have you ever seen Perfume, Story, Story of a Murderer? Yes, I have. Long See that long. final scene? The final scene when he whips out that ultimate perfume yeah. and everybody in that whole mm. like Coliseum thing just starts fucking... <laughs> Where can I get Bad. that? Where can I get that on Take A Lot? Because you're... Well, you have to pe- you have to get the scent of like <clears throat> nine, ten dead women. Yo. <laughs> yeah, well, I don't know how you're gonna do that. <laughs> this sounds like a perfume by Bill Cosby, guys. Yo. <laughs> <laughs> well, R. Kelly, bro. Oof, yeah, no. uh-huh. <laughs> All right, man. We can start the show. You start the show. Let's- Cool. So if you're wondering for any good gift ideas for Valentine's Day, this article has a suggestion that you give your partner the gift of an orgasm. I mean, yeah. 
Yeah, well, clearly, guys don't know or people don't know how to give each other orgasms without machines. I mean, yeah, because this whole article is like bio partner uh, sex toy. Yeah, I mean, you can give someone an orgasm without a sex toy. Yeah, you can. So definitely. maybe it's just to change it up, man. Have you ever brought a sex toy into the bedroom? Oh yes, it's a lot of fun. It is fun, yeah. Mm. I feel like yeah, I feel like we. But I'm just worried every time. Every time, like I'm doing the nasty and I hear it. I think shit is my barber here. <laughs> <laughs> hey, too much on the top, bro. No, sorry, I got a flashback. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah. Oh, oh while you're doing the nasty and it starts vibrating again. It's like, is that my phone? Is that my side hoe? <laughs> <laughs> I feel like I'm getting a what is that? Ghost pocket dial. <laughs> Ghost pocket dial. <laughs> and you're not even wearing pants. <laughs> Uh, uh, it's like wait I need to brush my teeth <laughs> <laughs> oh shit have you uh, ever bought a sex toy for somebody no no not at all I've bought lube um, oh, what kind of lube a couple of times and okay. massage oil okay yeah but that's about it I mean okay yeah uh, I bought a pocket pussy Oh, but that's for you. No, I'm joking. I've never bought that. What the fuck? Did they, they, I'm surprised at your reaction, Gav, bro. You're just like, oh, okay, that's very fun. Hey, bro, I'm glad I'm, you just didn't judge me at all. I'm progressive as fuck, bro. Right now, we're in my bro, sex you, lab. <clears throat> I'm progressive, yo. No, that's good, man. That's good. Yeah. <laughs> so you want a pocket pussy? No, I want a real pussy. I'm good, yeah. No, I don't, oh, want, okay. I don't, want, I don't want a pocket pussy, yeah. Um, has anybody bought you a sex toy? Uh, no. Yeah, it's funny. This article suggests I mean, uh, sex toys for men. Uh, maybe we can go down there. We can just give it a quick read. Sex toy so for men. So it asks you here, do you... So when you think... When you're picking out a, a, a sex toy, yes. I don't know if you should be thinking about yourself or the person you're giving it to. Exactly. Do you prefer clitoral, G-spot, vaginal, and anal stimulation or combination of these? Do you enjoy... Or love. Larger or small penises? Uh, do you like direct or indirect stimulation? Would you prefer intense or soft vibrations? Uh, I, bought able a, to answer these I bought a, a little toy for somebody once. Oh, like a vibrator? Yeah, like a little bullet, a bullet one. Um, I don't oh, want to okay. buy like a dildo because I don't want like anything bigger than me. The yeah, I know that. That's that's the thing, dude. Every time you go buy a dildo for someone, you got to make sure it's smaller than yours. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I Otherwise, you don't be you don't be competing with silicone, bro. <laughs> Damn, bro, I'm gonna lose every time, every time. It's like what? Are, what are you? And a robot, bro. <laughs> After a while, she's been like, "What are you even doing here? Why?" <laughs> oh, that's so funny, bro. Yeah, maybe I would but, mold mold my penis and then make that a, a little bit out of that. That could work. That's nice. Oh yeah. yeah, yeah, that's not a bad idea. That's not a bad idea. Or maybe mold my shit because I've taken some big logs. <laughs> Damn, <laughs> there's so many <laughs> levels to that joke. Yo, <laughs> oh, it's so bad, bro. <laughs> I respect you, but yo, I think I also fear you. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> Explains my background. <laughs> I said I was progressive, but whoa, I think the bus stops there. <laughs> uh, oh. <laughs> Uh, okay, but uh, read there what it says for him. It says the first thing you need to know before you, when girlfriend of the year for these toys ex um, exist. I, I th this kind of annoyed me about this article because it says your girlfriend of the year. I mean, what about gay couples and non-binary couples? So, I mean, yes. they also buy sex toys. Yes. It's not just yes. this monogamous man and woman thing. It kind yeah. of irritates me. Yes, yes, so, yes, yes. So. <laughs> Where do we complain? Who do we write to? The editor. The LGBTQ of... was holler at them. Yes. So look See, at this. We're on your side, guys. We out here fucking motherfucker uppers for you. <laughs> <laughs> uh, if you're, I like what it says. If your man is a little bit more open minded, you could even go for something like a prostate ma massager. A, pro a prostate ma massager. Yes. So, you know, I've, I've, I've got this. Uh, yeah, I don't know. You struggle with prostate. Uh, I don't know if you're struggling to find your own. <laughs> Because uh, you need to get your prostate checked. 
<laughs> you know, there's one time, um, you know, actually, I've, I did this, I've done this gag actually before. Um, and I, I don't do it often because it's a bit hectic too. Because, you know, how sensitive people are. Because it was about, it was about, it was about getting a urinary tract infection. So I got a UTI once. Uh, it's not very embarrassing. It's quite a common thing. A lot of people get it. How do you get it? Um, um, you can unprotected sex. Um, okay, no, say no more. Bacterial, no. bacterial yes. infection of underwear, uh, poor hygiene. I, I mean, guess you know, you just, sometimes you just <laughs> as a man, as a man, you don't shower for a few days. Those things happen, bro. You so know, you were a dirty motherfucker. Shit. Yeah, I was just being a fucking slob, bro, for a bit. You know, I mean, it doesn't mean that's not a reflection of who I am. I'm just saying. But women, women, it's actually you not very common. Shower after you go to the summit, bro. That's rule number one. Uh, yeah, so um, <laughs> apparently women women actually get UTIs um, majority yes, of the time. It's not yes. just, it's not very common with men. Yeah. Um, but anyway, so I got it, and then I thought I had prostate cancer, bro. So I went to the doctor because you know you Google your symptoms and shit, and you think fuck. Hey, doctor Google. So I went to the doctor. Bro. I went to the doctor at Vits, and it was a Nigerian doctor, bro. And I told okay. him to check. I was like, doc, man, I think I've got prostate cancer, man. There's something wrong. It, <laughs> and he's like, he's like, then he did the test and he's like, no, it's, it's not, it's just a UTI. And he's like, no, that, that thing, that prostate thing, that, that thing is useless. <laughs> now in my head, I was just like, no, you know, the guy was Nigerian. I was like, for you, it's not useless. <laughs> but for some of us, we need all the help we can get. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> Well, end of story, you uh, didn't have prostate cancer. Yeah, yeah, it was just a little minor UTI. Nice. Yeah. Um, yeah. yeah, no, what else can we say about this? Uh, so tell me, do, do you like to get your prostate massaged? I'm progressive, bro. Let's just say that, yeah? <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, the other gifts are cock ring, <laughs> penis sleeve, or... Have you no. ever tried a cock ring? I've always wanted to try a cock I've ring. I tried a cock ring. It was, it was too small. -ish. I think I'd prefer... Um, oh, it was too small. It didn't yeah, fit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Why don't you put it in like boiling water so it expands? <laughs> <laughs> okay. Then put it on my dick. Ah, it's hot. <laughs> or, put some, or put some butter or cooking oil. <laughs> why, is it, why does it smell like rama? <laughs> <laughs> Just one suck, just one suck, <laughs> and you know you're right. <laughs> Yo, have you ever thought uh, of these toys? A cock ring? No, a dude, sleeve, no. I'm a male I'm just... masturbator. Points if if vibes vibrates. Wow. Okay. I, I would like to try all these things though. I will... Yeah. What is a rabbit vibrator? Shall we Google what a rabbit vibrator is? You can do a quick search. I think it's a rabbit. Hey, I don't know. Let's actually look. I'm making a guesstimation here. Yeah. Don't know what this is. Is it one shape is. like Bugs Bunny? Yeah. Apologies if this takes us to porn, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah. <laughs> oh shit! This that actually might do it. Might do that. Yeah. Let's see. Ah. Oh. <laughs> I'm just worried in images. Oh, here it is. Yeah. Oh, the rabbit one is the one with the two like little fingers yeah. that like bunny ears. Yes. Oh, okay. Yeah. So it looks like the dude from um. Was it Captain Phillips or whatever? Where it says, "Look at me, I'm the captain of this ship now." <laughs> <laughs> Wait, let's find that meme. Let's find that meme. Let's find. Wait, look at me. I'm the hey, captain hey. now. <laughs> look at me. See, Yo, this guy same was thing. A one hit one day. Never actually. So you check it out. Day. Yeah, there he is. There he is. It's exactly the same as a rabbit vibrator. Mm -hmm. <laughs> So if you go, if you type in black rabbit vibrator, uh -oh, uh -oh. there we go. <laughs> Whoa. Wow. <laughs> I am not walking in these waters, bro. You can swim by yourself in this little pool. Yes. Decline to comment. <laughs> that's how I see. No, that's just how I see those vibrators, bro. That's, I don't uh, see vibrators. <laughs> <laughs> cool don't be alarmed it is what it is doctor reveals how long sex lasts on average um 
How long did you think sex lasts on average before you read this? Well, I mean, no, before I mean before I read this article, I already knew because I, I mean, I saw the re- I've seen of research papers as well where okay. different species have different species like different time. How long it's like a jackrabbit? It's just a couple of pounds and, yeah. and then it's done. So, yeah, human beings, it's... according to science, five point four minutes is average. Are you below yeah. average or average or above average? I guess I guess it depends on my mood. <laughs> so <laughs> okay do you count foreplay as the beginning or penetration as well the i mean i think i personally think 5.4 minutes of pounding is uh quite a it's quite uh <laughs> of clapping uh, cheeks <laughs> yeah that's um i mean i think that's for fit people they probably can do it go longer as well you know if you yeah. exercise and stuff so runners and stuff like that athletes hmm. Hmm. Mm-hmm. so not you <laughs> but i'm sh- but i'm sure bodybuilders it's 0. 0.4 minutes yeah. <laughs> Shit, bro. 5.4 minutes have is you long. i mean have yeah. you ever timed yourself well it depends like i mean if you can fuck through three songs then that's about five that's a bit that's longer than 5.4 minutes okay like radio songs not like obviously house music no. oh you mean like deep house no then you'll be fucking for like 15 minutes bro <laughs> <laughs> yo bro you won't stop fucking Shit. It's fucking a deep house, bro. No, it'll never end. <laughs> yeah. 5.4 minutes is the intro, bro, on a deep house song. Yeah. <laughs> Check this out. This this article suggested that uh, yeah, you listen to that Bohemian you fuck through Rhapsody. Bohemian Rhapsody because yeah. it's so you your mind it, will it retards your aril- arousal. That's what it says there. Yeah, I just punch my dick. <laughs> I just think about test cricket, bro. <laughs> Bangladesh. That's uh, hilarious, bro. Yeah, that is hilarious. <laughs> Day one stumps. <laughs> That's so funny, bro. Uh, <laughs> I once thought about test cricket, and I came when I thought about the toss. <laughs> <laughs> don't know, I thought maybe it was because you were thinking about fine leg. <laughs> oh. <laughs> or square leg <laughs> or third leg <laughs> Yo. and when I don't uh. come I use the Duckworth Lewis system <laughs> <laughs> Yo. one uh. round divided by 50 strokes times <laughs> yeah Okay, so I guess if you start going to anal, then you might be crossing boundaries. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, fuck! That was good. Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> but sometimes I ask the girl, "How's it?" And she gives me the thing. <laughs> okay. Mm-hmm. Well, yeah, no. If you want to go longer than average, <clears throat> this definitely helps. But yeah. This is in regards for flowers. A tiny bit of Viagra is enough to keep fresh cut flowers standing up for an extra week. How fascinating is that, bro? That's crazy, bro. Yeah. And that you can. Uh... It's only one like milligram of Viagra that a flower needs to live a bit longer and stay up. Shit. So what would happen if you put like a whole pill, like <laughs> have like rigor mortis or some shit? <laughs> Becomes That's fucking girl. your girl, bro. <laughs> <laughs> like, babe, are you deflowering? <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> yeah, no. It's so interesting. This is like fascinating to, for me. Um, what is in Viagra that it does this? That's insane. No, what's more interesting is that what are, what's in flowers is the same thing what's in a penis. The enzymes that causes... Uh, erectile dysfunction the oh same, i see the same enzymes is the same yeah, it's the same science so oh, hectic so if your penis was a flower I guess, what flower would it be <laughs> uh it would be a br- uh, <laughs> I was say a brown rose but there's no such thing <laughs> i think this rose is dead guys <laughs> <laughs> Uh, shit. Uh. I don't know, maybe a sunflower? <laughs> nice. 
Yeah, that's, that's, what would yours be, bro? Probably like a King Pro Tier or something, yeah, man. Like, like yeah. Yeah, that's all kinds of fucked up. <laughs> <laughs> you check yourself for STDs, bro. <laughs> I think that's a medical condition, bro. <laughs> hey, you need to get that shit checked, bro. Like, yo. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Uh, yeah, but you were gonna say something about the enzymes. Me? No, I wasn't gonna say anything. I, you? I mean, mm. I only learned that from this article. That's okay. what. But it says you what you choose to do with the fo other forty nine milligrams is up to you. <laughs> yeah, I like that. I was like, oh, that's a nice touch, yeah. Yeah. Uh, have you ever used uh, performance enhancement drugs? No, never, man. Is I don't it? struggle with that. You know? I once took so. like the Chinese Viagra. Dr. Long. Yes, like, like like something like that, but the pull, there was a pull. Yeah, and did it work? Yeah, no, I was hard. Yo, I came because I came quick and I was still hard. I was like, oh, let's keep going. Yeah. yeah. That's crazy. Yeah. Oh, wait, I have actually taken one. I'm, I'm, I just remembered now. Uh, Ngobo, Ngobo gave me one. <laughs> yeah, I took it and then I went to my girl's place, the, well, the girl I was seeing at the time. And the worst thing happened is that she didn't want to have sex, bro. So I said, yeah. rock hard the whole night, bro. <laughs> Wasn't just... your heart racing? <laughs> bro. <laughs> and she was like, like really sad in a sad mood. And I was like, Jesus, like, how do I do this? Did you take the, the Viagra? Well, the, the sort of like it's knockoff gener generic Viagra, whatever. Did you take it because you wanted to like tear that ass up? Well, I took it because I wanted to try it. I wanted to see what it does, like oh. how hectic it is, <laughs> you know? Obviously, I also wanted to tear that ass up, you know? <laughs> I want to put I mean, my flag. I mean, those are the benefits. <laughs> those are the benefits, bro. I want to leave my mark, yeah. They must know. <laughs> <laughs> but it was, it was interesting. It was like a red pill, bro. Mm. It's like Morpheus. It's like Morpheus was, was Morpheus to me. It's like, you want the red pill? What's going on? <laughs> uh, <laughs> chose the red pool <laughs> i chose the red pool bro nice so, <laughs> yeah yeah but it was it ended up being a downer <laughs> over 12 hours yo what do you so, do bro yo, just drink water hopefully like like it just gets out your yo system. go to the bathroom and just knock it out so that it just try it flat but that doesn't work as well because then it just starts hurting so <laughs> just we ride it out no pun intended. An influencer tattooed her cat, and people are outraged. Yo, number one rule of the internet, bro. Don't fuck with cats. Mm. So, yeah. Yeah. That's true. That's, that's exactly what I thought of, like, that documentary. Yeah. Don't fuck with cats. Don't fuck with yeah. cats, yo. So she's probably cancelled. Ah, why would you do this? You know, in this article, she says she didn't, um, what's it, castrate her cat? Because that would be cruel. <laughs> yeah yeah i know i know people do that i actually know people who do this thing where they they keep um wild animals as pets and what they do is they like i mean like in tiger king for example they cut yeah. off the nails so they don't scratch and grind down the teeth so when they bite it doesn't oh shit uh, yes. yeah. so that and that's quite cruel because cats especially need the claws for like stretching and stuff like that and yeah. it's like their natural and yeah. teeth to eat bro like i mean it's yeah it's, it's quite like cruel taking away our i don't know our fans <clears throat> yeah but uh, i mean i don't I, I don't think anything's that bad with this whole tattoo this cat now looks pretty sexy man it's got a tramp <laughs> step and everything i, I don't even like these <laughs> i don't like these skin cats you can cover that shit up with tattoos bro <laughs> you imagine you see a cat, a ta a cat with a tattoo thug life <laughs> <laughs> so it's meow life bro <laughs> it's meow life then times nine <laughs> It's meow life. <laughs> wow. <laughs> wow. Shit. <laughs> or, or, or a tattoo that says poor society. Oh. <laughs> or feed the poor. <laughs> uh, oh, shit. <laughs> but the reason I don't like these cats is because they, they get acne, bro. It's so gross. It's, yeah, I don't know, bruh. It needs to, a cat needs to be fluffy, bruh. A pet needs yeah, to be Yeah, it needs to be furry, bruh. So, 
Yo, this chick's biggest mistake was getting the type of cat in the first place, bro. <laughs> you know? When I mean, when I when I pet this cat or touch this type of cat, like I'm just thinking, yo, man, someone get the oven ready. <laughs> or where's the marinade at? <laughs> Cook the skin, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, so mm, I guess she tattooed the story. Mm. I mean, the moral of the story, I mean, the, the conclusion is that she tattooed her pussy. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, it's from not fucking with cats to not fucking with. Oh, hippos, whoa, 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 wait, 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 oh, wait, 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 wait. Start oh, again because no. <laughs> people just asking you to register, bro, for the vaccine. <laughs> Pablo Escobar, why scientists want to kill Colombia's hippos? So, Pablo was so rich, he opened his own zoo. He had his own yeah. zoo and he had a thing for hippos. He got some hippos in there and now the hippos are an invasion species. Ev so evasive. Invasive, yeah. yeah they're, evasive they're species. They're not yeah. meant to be there, basically. Nah? Yeah, like Indian miners. Yeah. <laughs> yes. yeah. The bird, yeah. not the, the people. Um, yeah, you don't get Indian <laughs> miners. <laughs> They're not uh, biologically built for that. We all saw what happened in Maracana. We know what. Uh, yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. So this is interesting, bro. Like uh, they don't want to call them. Well, the scientists want to call them because it's going to be bad in three, four hundred, um, in thirty, forty years. It's just going to become. It's it's endangering the rest of the ecosystem there. Yeah, because the nothing's hunting the hippo out there. There's no lions in Colombia. Exactly, bro. Yeah. So what maybe what you should do is take all the tigers that chill in the US that people keep as pets and put them out in Colombia. Mm. <laughs> just to balance the eco balance that so there's an abundance of hippos for them to eat. And the tigers can also have a jungle to live in. Okay. They were so balancing the ecosystem. I think hippos are are wild though, yeah? There was one in four ways the other day. Yeah, no, wasn't that the insurance? <laughs> Oh wow! Okay. <laughs> <laughs> so they call these the cocaine hippos because obviously Pablo. Um, yeah, that's so fucked up, right? Any name of Pablo is just associated with cocaine. When they say cocaine hippos, I'm thinking these co these hippos have like their noses are just filled with all this powder, bro. <laughs> wow! Imagine a, a hippo <laughs> snorting a coke. That line must be huge, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Imagine a hippo putting cocaine in his gums, brother. <laughs> yeah, wow. Yeah, no, apparently because it was humble beginnings, though. It was only like four of them. Yeah, it was, it was three. It was one male and three females. Yeah. And then now. And then that cocaine orgies and one thing led to. Yeah, bro. Co <laughs> they were having cocaine parties and shit, just like fucking. And <laughs> no, it's a party out there, bro. <laughs> yeah, bro. Fucking Pablo Escobar owns us. Let's fuck. <clears throat> Yo, imagine, bro. Yeah, man. How many? How many? Did they say there. You know, there's thirty thirty animals that need to be called. There's about a thousand four hundred species now. Yo. It will reach over a thousand four hundred species by twenty thirty four. Specimen, sorry. Yeah. Yes, man. Uh, how do you for the hippos, man? Why can't they transport the hippos back to Africa? Yo, bro. Like, what? Are you gonna you know, put them on like a ship carrier or whatever? <laughs> How are you going to get them there, bro? I just have ideas, yo. I don't have solutions, bro. <laughs> because, I mean, is Col Colombia landlocked? Does it have an ocean? It does have an ocean. Yeah, it does have an ocean. Yeah, yeah then they can put it on, like, ships. Hmm. How do you think it got know. there in the first place? So let me see. Colombia, man. I want to go to Colombia, bro. I'd love to go to Colombia. But Colombia's got one of the highest murder rates in the world, isn't it? Uh, what the fuck? This thing's showing me Col <laughs> Columbia sports. Yes, <laughs> yes. Columbia's like the <laughs> gallery. I have to type in Columbia country, Jesus, because it's Columbia sportswear and oh, it's Columbia. I forgot. <laughs> Columbia. <laughs> Columbia, man. Okay, it does. It does have an ocean. Yes. Oh, look at that. <gasps> oh, I want to go to all these countries. The Caribbean Sea. Yeah, no, the, the, the Americas, like the South Americas would be nice, or Middle Americas. Oh, here's a better map, actually. And Cuba. 
Let's go to Cuba, bro. Yeah. Or Costa Rica. Or the whole, that whole area. Olof. 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 Yeah, dude. So, but anyway, these hippos, bro. Have you ever seen one of these things munch a watermelon, bro? Uh, no, I haven't, bro. Yo, I've seen a video where they're just throwing this whole watermelon in its mouth and it's just crunch. crunch. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, these things are killers, man. They kill more people. Imagine, this, imagine what it would do to your skull, bro. Yeah, it fucks it's people up. They're very territorial. So if you see a hippo, yo, go in the other direction, man. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And they can run, bro, even though they're big. Yeah. I, I want to see that. Check, like, like a whole hippo like, runs. Mm. Yeah, let's actually check on YouTube. We can do that because we have the internet. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> it's not slow today, so. <laughs> uh, hip. Bo Let's put your ad block running. Yeah. Full speed. Yeah. Just remember when you're zooming into these. Okay, I'll leave it like this. Yo. Oh, shit. Let's see? Oh, snap. Is that yeah. it? Oh, it's. it's yeah, it kind of skips. <laughs> it's kind of skipping really quick. It's like Lionel Messi, bro. <laughs> yes. <laughs> wow, Lionel Messi runs like a hippo. Who knew? <laughs> Check how quick that is! Yay! <laughs> Leaving, yeah, eating. Look at the dust. <laughs> That's what I'm saying, bro. Like, eat my dust, motherfucker. <laughs> Literally, shit. Yo, okay, let's. Yo. Wow. Okay, let's see how they have sex. Just so <laughs> since it is Valentine's Day. <laughs> yes. <laughs> uh, hippo sex. You see how how it came to be. So hey, that's a dick, <laughs> yo. The dick looks like a ginger root. Some, what is? <laughs> what the hell was that? Was that I was beer? giving head, bro. <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa. Now we're just seeing all sorts of animals fucking. Six nine. Six nine. <laughs> yo, cheetahs. Cheetah, cheetah, cheetah probably fucks quick. <laughs> you know, cheetah's probably that, cheating that, that, on that. another cheating. <laughs> <laughs> We're watching cheat. We're literally watching cheetahs. <laughs> this is the best cheetahs episode I've ever seen. <laughs> Where's the white dude when you need him? <laughs> yeah, the confrontation. Yeah. <laughs> Who the fuck is this? <laughs> Who the fuck is this? Oh, look at that foreplay. Yeah. <laughs> we are Joel at nine nine. <laughs> <laughs> Where's Jab Jab? Jup jup, jup Sorry, I'm the jaguars. Let's cut. I'm trying to find hippos, fucking bro. It's just showing me every animal in the kingdom, bro. Jesus, there's even pigs. No, thank you. Yo, the female one looks know like she's not that into it, eh? Yeah, in, in the animal kingdom, that's true, bro. Mm. Dogs. I, I, actually, there's no hippos in this whole video, so kind of. It was, waste. It was just uh, anyway. That was it's a, a good way to climax. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> they're gonna smoke a cigarette right now, bro. <laughs> Goddamn cheating bastard. <laughs> uh, mm, baby, I love you. I love you. <laughs> <laughs> Happy Valentine's Day. Look at this. Look at this sly fox. <laughs> With a foxy lady. Whoa! It's getting a rush, bro. Slow down there, tiger. Slow down, fox, brother. bitch. I'm not a tiger. Mm. <laughs> oh, at last. Oh, there, there, there. That's his cum face. Do you see his cum face, bro? Yo, he's back. He's got that post night clarity. Uh, <laughs> uh, <laughs> it's funny, bro. Like, how do you have sex and just watch around, look around, like, for danger at the same time, bro? It's... It's like James Bond having sex. What the hell? They're stuck. <laughs> you guys, dick is stuck. That's true. I've seen, I've seen this happen to dogs. <laughs> Don't pull out, baby. Don't pull out. <laughs> yeah, like you're trying to pull out. It's like nah. <laughs> Trap. <I'm> keeping your <laughs> babies. <laughs> <laughs> it's so funny. In the animal kingdom, they do uh, <clears throat> have to fuck quick because uh, they're always being hunted. <laughs> Exactly, bro. They're all looking around. Like, get, get this over quick, bro. Get this. No eye contact. Like, yo, that's why they invent doggy style. Like, just get this done. <laughs> uh, 
Yeah, anyway. Yeah, okay, I think we can end it. I don't know. Yeah, we can Damn, you see, I told you his dick is stuck, bro. <laughs> but anyway, that's enough of that before we get stuck on this topic. <laughs> <laughs> that looks like a you problem, man. Um, <laughs> uh, yeah. Cool, ladies and gentlemen. That's the end of the show. Episode six. That's a wrap. Um, yeah, no, it's man. seven, bro. Episode seven. Episode seven. Sorry. Yeah, seven. Luck. Lucky number seven. Hope you guys get lucky today on Valentine's Day. Yeah, man. Uh, just remember, share the love. Lots of love. Unconditional love. Keep it real. You know, and strap it up. Strap it up, guys. And uh, yeah, the most important type of love is self love, right? Yes, that too. If you don't have a partner, just spoil yourself. Take yourself out on a date. You know, who knows? Maybe you might find your hand. 